Millions of people use Facebook and that makes for some fertile feeding grounds when it comes to scams. Now sometimes what the scammers do is use legit company names to try to lure you in. That's the case right now as folks are sharing an offer for a free trip. But don't fall for it. It's a scam. Jai Cunningham has more in tonight's Afterline Consumer Alert. Someone is not being too friendly in the skies or on Facebook. There's a post circulating promising free trips via Delta, something the company has said is not true. We give them a few tips and tricks just to look, you know, and make sure that they're checking out. Uh, make sure it's a reputable Facebook page. Uh, make sure you know which websites you're filling these forms out on. If it's not Delta's main site or, or whoever's um, company's main site, then it's probably a little too good to be true. This particular post is similar to one that involved Hawaiian Airlines earlier this year. And other airlines have been targeted in the past, too. Some things to be on the lookout for when navigating around Facebook. Keep an eye out if outdated branding is being used. If it's not hosted on the company's website, that could be a big hint. Another red flag, if there are no contest rules available. And what kind of entry method is required? All they're thinking about is like the opportunity to win a free flight or, you know, some sort of like trip, um, which is great, especially during the summer months. Everyone wants a vacation. But at the same time, um, little bits of information like your address, um, your full name, um, things that seem pretty innocent can be used to perpetrate um, identity theft. If you have a consumer concern or are interested in becoming an Action Line volunteer, give us a call at 591-0222 weekdays between 11 in the morning and 1 in the afternoon or send an email to actionline at kh12.com. Jai Cunningham, kh 2 News.